looking at the spot. <clears throat> Officially back at the Dreams HQ. Man, it was only three months, but it seemed like it was so much longer. All right, just got back to the apartment with Dusty. As you can see, probably can guess it would be. Yo, so a lot has happened. Last time you see me on this very, very same couch. I just need to get a job for creative shit. Just be like everybody else. I was leaving Columbia. I was exhausted from eight months working 10 to 12 hours a day trying to build all dreams and still didn't have what it was, how we can build it and make revenue. Because we do what we want to make tens of millions of dollars. We're not here to make little bit of money, we're here to make big money. I can't take care of my family without no money. You can't take care of your family without no money. We need to make this shit big because the big money is the more people we can support. So I was just exhausted. I was exhausted and I wanted to be transparent in the last video and tell you guys like, look, this is really what goes on and I really document these things. I really document myself going through these, this, this complete process of not just building a business, but actual life. Always when I come back to Buffalo, I have these these type of mixed feelings and because of the relationships and just the people, man. Like once I got out of this city, like I just started meeting better people. Um, I just never, I've never fit in here at all. Just never fit in at all. Now I'm just gonna sit here and think about my dad and think about my grandmother. But I went back to the United States for three months and Yo, yo, so what's going on guys? I just finished bringing my stuff in the house um, and uh, of course got, got my computer. Boy, oh boy. Uh, it was a very, very good experience to be back home. One, two, three. Happy birthday to my you. Mama. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear my baby mama. Mama Happy birthday to came to Columbia and I decided, look, I'm gonna get out of Atlanta. Yo, this is moving day. You know what I'm saying? This is it. This, this is it. I'm gonna move to Columbia. I was just fed up. But yeah, I moved from Atlanta, Georgia to South America and Cartagena, Colombia. I was fed up with everything in the States. I was fed up with the prices. I, I, was, I was fed up with the culture. I was fed up with the politics, just everything. And it was almost like the grass was greener on the other side, right? I mean, the soccer nets, I mean, they don't even have nets on the, so on, on, on the, uh, on the soccer goals. Uh, I would love to get them brand new goals I would love to bring them sneakers. I would love to uh, paint the cement over um, with an all dreams theme. Uh, even the heck with the United States, I'm out of there. And I'm never going back. And then being in, in Colombia and Cartagena for eight months, 
straight. Of course, I went back, you know, here and there. But being based in Colombia, all of the challenges that came with that, the language barrier. Okay. La ventaja que ella tiene sobre los demás es que mientras los demás descansan, ella trabaja y casi ninguno el papá es el entrenador. Say like a, well, it was a athlete. It was a, a athlete, like it was a competition, kind of professional athlete. The culture barrier, being alone. Even how do you make money and how do you build a company with all of these different barriers. So I was going through all of that at the same time. And going back to the United States was, it was just a refreshing situation. It, I mean, it was, it was just refreshing to spend time with my family again. to finally find what all dreams is. The confirmation went through. All right, so there it is. Officially. Officially, Delaware C Corp. So we didn't know any of this stuff up until this point. That, in order to even try to get VC funds, you have to have a Delaware C Corp, but now we have one. This right here is the corporate book for All Dreams Inc. just came in today. So definitely wanted to document that real fast. But this is the corporate book. This is going to be um, a billion dollar company. Somebody receives this in the mail. Oh my God. Open it up. He's got his face on the bottom, right? All dreams, believe, achieve. Dream box. Wow, this is perfect. This is perfect. My goodness, this is my real reaction. Uh, so right now I'm on a meeting with the trademark lawyer, uh, Xavier Haley, and uh, we're talking about the trademarks for this thing right here, the Dream Box and the Dreamers Vault. In the Explorer page, you go and you can see how it is done. We have at the bottom profile, saved videos or profiles, my earnings and Explorer. You can pretty much scroll this particular page and click on any one of the video man this is this is super like this is a very very monumental day um i have been working on getting this dream box since i've been back you know like the, you know i had the idea of the dream box when i was in cartagena and that's kind of where i came up with the idea for the dream box and um you know i had a white dream box that I, you know, that I made for for Angie. Um, it didn't have all of the elements, but now we have, an, you know, we have an actual sample of what this product will look like. Right? You have the box with the Dreamer note card inside that you scan to watch his videos. You have the bracelet, the Dream Supporter bracelet that you will get in supporting Noah and also get his t-shirt. So this is like a, you know, it's, it's like a collect, you know, it's, it's like a collector's item for a kid that's going after his dream, right? Um, just imagine, just imagine if Michael Jordan's going after his dream and he had one of these, what value would that be right now, right? Sometimes you're so engulfed into what you're doing. When you record, there's uh, these, these media stuff, yeah. That you have to get out of it 
in order to even think and see things clearly. Hey, what happened? I'm finna eat. I thought you were studying. And that's what happened. That's what happened. I was on a tail end as I was leaving on a tail end of what the heck is this company? What do I want this company to be? And having that time in the States and having that time with my family and having that time of norm of normalcy. Okay, this is a big time to document right here. We have a brand new channel. Paris Reviews Disney and Today, November 19th, 2023, Paris right here has officially one subscriber. <laughs> gave me so much bandwidth to continue this journey. And again, I just want to be transparent about building in public and building a company in, in, in public. This has been my office for the last three months. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday I go to New York City and Monday I go back to Cartagena. So yeah, I haven't been there for some time now, so it's gonna be interesting how the how the apartment looks, how the how the office looks and everything. So yeah, and man. I have been putting on some pounds and I don't like the way I, you know, <laughs> I don't feel healthy, so I need to get that back. So this is what three months in America has done to me. And I'm going on a new journey and I just think I look freaking horrible. Look at my stomach. Oh, man. So, <laughs> look, I'm probably like, had to be about 2.30 maybe. So the journey begins January 1st when I get back to Colombia to get my body back right because this shit ain't gonna work. I probably ate so much wings and pizza and Thanksgiving, Christmas, uh, all of that. So, but this has to go. Looking at the spot. Overall, overall, I don't have the feeling that I used to have about the United States. The great part about what I'm building here is I always have access to the United States and I have access to Colombia and this beautiful um, HQ that, that, you know, that, that I've built here and that's what I'm looking forward to moving forward in this year and making content and showing you guys the actual journey. I'm happy to be back and I'm happy to be in a different space. As an entrepreneur, as a person in life, we go through real things. And I think it's so many things that's shown on the internet that our peaches and cream and not the real shit is shown. And I have to share the real journey, even if it's dark, because sometimes it is dark. It's not always light. Yo, yo, what's good, what's good? It is, it's 8 a.m. This is the fifth day of the year, 2024. And look, um, y'all was eating too much when I was in the States. 
So I'm about to get correct all of that. You know, I got my boy, you know what I'm saying, Freddie. This is gonna be our first day at the gym. And um, y'all about to witness a transformation. Ah, gracias. So my man, you know what I mean? <laughs> I got to forget the water, you know what I mean? You know, help me out. So we headed to the gym right now. We, um, we got our memberships yesterday. So, everything locked up. We headed to the gym right now. First day, we are back in the barrio. And um, yeah, so what's going on right now? is it's a great time it's a great time it's a lot going on in cartagena right now man it's a lot going on here um like freaking closing all the clubs like it's a new mayor so they like closing clubs and everything like that and um trying to get rid of the prostitution which is like the one of the main tourist attractions for gringos here <laughs> they come for the women of course you know what i mean the women are beautiful but from what somebody sent me they have closed the top four clubs that guys go and pick women at so that's dolce vita Delirium space and it's another one and um, Man, this shit is big news because most Travelers travel to Cartagena as far as like passport bros To go and um, And um, Have fun with the women this is, I'm not gonna talk about that stuff because it's not my life, right? I'm not a passport bro per se. I'm a businessman. And my new model for this year, of course, my, my channel name is I am Hassan El Sadiq, but I'm the introverted dreamer. Like, that's what I am. I'm, a, I'm an introverted dreamer. But, I'm a businessman, I'm an entrepreneur, I'm a builder. And that's what my channel is about, is showing that you can actually build something, being from wherever you're from. Channel is about supporting dreams, telling stories. Uh, inspiration. And I'm looking to do three weekly uploads for a year straight. And that's my goal. So, yeah, headed to the gym right now, and um, that's what we—that's what we doing. Bro, I gotta step your creativity game up. You feel what I'm saying? This is called creativity. This is storyline. You feel what I'm saying? Please like, subscribe, and comment, and continue to follow this journey.